at WFMS, we have just a few quick reminders and updates as we approach the end of the week. The Creative Writing Club will meet on Monday. The Musical Theater and Chorus Fundraiser is almost over. Our Science Bowl teams will meet on Monday. We have a brief sports update for you today. We have some fundraiser news for you today. We have our Throwback Thursday segment for you today. The WFMS Admiral Announcement Network starts now. board admirals thank you for joining us this morning on wfms the admirals announcement network i'm nora and i'm amelia welcome to your home for news announcements and more on wfms now for today's news and announcements science bowl will meet monday for our study sessions and tuesday we will meet for practices please report to miss browning's room at 345 and have you right here by five the creative writing club will be meeting this next monday from 345 to 430 this club will run for the first semester and will meet in miss Allen's ELA room, Orange 254. Hope to see you there. Our musical theater and chorus fundraiser ends on November 2nd. They will be selling tumblers with a chorus logo that anyone can purchase. Here is the QR code and there are flyers posted around the school with the QR code or students can stop by the chorus room in the mornings for more information in room 160C. We have a very important yearbook announcement so if you have picture retakes and you want to choose which one of the pictures you want to be in the yearbook, come to the library at some point during the school day before November 22nd. If you do not choose, yearbook staff will choose for you. That's it for news. Now for our Throwback Thursday segment exploring this day in history. I'm Daniel. And I'm Elena. Now for our Throwback Thursday as we look at this day in history. Did you know that on this day in 1517, Martin Luther posted the 95 Theses on the door of the Wittenberg Palace Church, marking the start of the Protestant Reformation in Germany? On this day in 1846, a heavy snowfall trapped the Donner Party in the Sierra Nevada Mountains. Did you know that on this day in 1864, Nevada became the 36th state? On this day in 1941, work on the Mount Rushmore Monument was completed. On this day in 1956, Rear Admiral G.J. Duffick became the first person to land an airplane at the South Pole. On this day in 1992, Pope John Paul II admitted that the Roman Catholic Church had erred in convicting Galileo of heresy 350 years earlier. History is always in the making. What will your history be? Now for a short sports brief. Hi, I'm Liddy. And I'm Annie. Now for a quick sports update. Basketball season has begun. And next week, we will have two games here at home. On November 4th, we will take on Carnes at home. And on November 7th, we will take on Harden Valley here at home. So mark your calendars. Saturday, November 2nd, 10 a.m. at Gibbs High School, the JV 7th grade football team will take on Gibbs at the semi at, in the semifinal game. If we win, we go to the championship game next week. If we lose, the season is over. Gibbs is currently number two, and we are currently number three. It is a huge game, and the boys need fans there to cheer them on. Let's show up. Go ads! That's it for our sports. Now back to the news desk for our closing. Thank you for joining us this morning on WFMS, Admiral's News Network. We hope you have a great day and evening. Make good choices. Be kind. Stay safe. And, and we, we will see you tomorrow. tomorrow.